Hi, this is Aprajita from Avaya Serviceability Engineering team. In this video, we will learn how to configure speed servers for Avaya Aura Experience Portal 6.0. In this exercise, we will be configuring both TTS as well as ASR speech engines. Let us begin our exercise by logging into Experience Portal Manager's web administration with username as admin and its password. On the home page, if you look at the left pane, we have to click on speed servers residing under system configurations. This page shows that there is no ESR server configured for the system yet. And there is no server configured for TTS as well. So let's try to add another TTS server by clicking on button add on this web page. This opens up an add TTS server web page. We have to specify any name for the TTS server. In our case, we are configuring a Nuance TTS server. So I have named it as Nuance. For engine type, we have three different options available for us. One is IBM WebSphere Voice Server. Next one is Lookwindow and third one is Nuance. In our case, as we are configuring a Nuance server, I click on Nuance. Now we have to provide the IP address of the Nuance TTS server. Next option is base port which is default for each speech engine. So in Nuance it is 4900. Then we have to specify the total number of licenses that can be used by Experience Portal Manager. In our case it is 10. Next option is new connection per session which is by default no for Nuance as well as for Lookwindow but it should be set yes for IBM WebSphere. After this, we have list of voices that we can configure for our TTS server to use. We can select single voice as well as multiple voices from this list. Now we have MRCP specific settings. We can configure ping interval, response time, protocol version which can be MRCP v1 or v2. Then RTSP URL is taken by default for the speech engine type we have configured. Let's now click on button save to save the changes. Now this page shows a confirmation message that the information has been saved. And under TTS tab we can see the newly configured TTS server listed. Now let us configure an ASR speech server as well by clicking on ASR tab here. Then click on add to add another ASR server to the system. It opens up an add ASR server page, which is quite similar to add TTS server page that we have just gone through. So first of all, we'll give a name to identify this ASR server. Let's name it as Nuance ASR as we are configuring a Nuance ASR speech server. In engine type, choose Nuance. Give the IP address of Nuance ASR speech server here. Leave the default base port value here. Then enter the number of licenses that we want to configure for ASR here. New connection per session remains no for Nuance as well as Lookwindow. In languages section, we can choose a single language or multiple languages at a time. Then there is MRCP settings section where we can configure ping interval, response timeout, protocol version which can be MRCP v1 or v2. Then RTSP URL is taken by default for the speech engine type we have configured. Let's now save the changes by clicking on button save. Now this page shows a confirmation that the information we have entered has been saved. Plus it shows the new Nuance ASR server listed below. So this completes our demonstration. Thank you for your time today. We welcome questions, comments and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. For more details and related technical information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.